Let's look something up real quick, like. Okay, that's what I need. Hey, that game was fun nonsense. This game is just also fun nonsense. Oh, whoops. Okay. Let's do it. Uh, probably going to go for 100% ish. twin yeah I'm gonna have to it's been a while since I did Dead Rising 2 and even longer since I actually did the kind of like all survivors attempt which I'm gonna do today, this time so we're gonna try to get all survivors try to beat all uh all psychopaths hey. um Now we know his name. Yeah, yeah. Look, I need you to sign this release form before you go out there. Oh, and uh, don't forget to include your next of kin. Her name is Katie. And now we've had both main characters introduced. How nice. Can you take her somewhere safe? Also, welcome back from I'll vacation. The, green room. the Chuck Green Room. Go with the nice man. Yeah, nothing bad is going to happen. See, I have a list next to me of people I need to save and things I need to do. We're going to try to go for all achievements, but I don't know if we're going to be able to do them all in one playthrough. She does never take her headphones off. Are we going to save my face? Probably. It got punched a lot in uh, in Wonderful 101. Hopefully it'll be punched less here. But those are zombies. Hey, buddy. I heard you lost your wife in Vegas. I guess you suck at killing zombies. Otherwise, she'd still be around. <laughs> Man, I can't wait to kill you. Yes, everybody cared about Willamette. But tonight, America, we're going to get a little payback. Uh, yeah, he will be on fire. We will be murdering him eventually. This is a really long intro, by the way. By this point, wonderful one to one, I was already playing. And now it's time for America's most dangerous game show. It's what? America's top model? Terror is reality. Can't help but notice the subtitles are lagging just a little bit behind. By the way, let me know how the uh, sound balance is. I might have to go fix it a little bit. Well, America, are you hungry for a little terror? That's a hell of a coat he has on. Tonight, 
That's something you should do with zombies. Poke them, you know. Uh, which little low, the game or me? Game's a little bit low? Okay. I'll have to look into that after this. Also, Leon is a tremendous asshole, even in this. Going for the th what, the zombies with the uh, pink balls in their heads makes them explode, and they will take out uh, nearby zombies. Which is why my points are so much more than theirs. Winning first place gets me extra money. And some extra experience. We start up at a higher level, which is nice. Dialogue changes a little bit depending on what place you're in, but it's about it. It's not actually important to the story. Let's wipe them off and hose them down. Let me hear it, people. And show some love for our winner tonight. He's a hero. He's a survivor. He's Chuck Green. Hi, folks. I'm Chuck Green. I don't know why these two are such tremendous bitches. They're just they're just bitches all over the place, I swear. Yeah, we shouldn't kill zombies. We should let them kill us. Just a little bit radical. These are average citizens, by the way. Important note. Hey, look, money. Since that's not an option, you know. Okay. Hey, you know where the green rooms are? Yeah, take the elevator up a floor and then straight down the hallway. You can't miss it. Hey, look, it's one of the last nice people we will see in the entire game. So we got some money. We got some experience. Still going to be at level 1, though, which kind of sucks. Okay, who wants to see a bitch again? Totally a big man. Absolutely a big man. 
Oh, man, look at that. I'm just getting insulted all day long here. like the mirror. Okay. Here we go. Time to get insulted more. My manhood don't exist much. Oh, I'm gonna like my 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 penis and ability in bed is gonna be nonstop made fun of between the two of the two of them. Also, wagging your hips like that has got to hurt. Good night, ladies. Okay. So what we're probably gonna end up doing is we're gonna do. A playthrough to do everything. Like all of these survivors. And then depending on what time I have between survivors. Um, that will then give me... I will then go and look at some of the side stuff. And some of the like optional... Uh, like some of the optional stuff. Can't we kill once the other dies too? Uh, eventually. They are some of the psychopaths uh, in like, I think it's day two. Oh God. Oh God, she got me. She got me. Man, he turned really fast. Like really, really fast. I'm not sure why Chuck wouldn't just stay in the elevator, but, you know. And taken down. Okay. So, Sean is dead. Let's grab some weapons here. Man, some of these guys are turning really fast. Okay, so none of the people in this early section can be saved. Yep, drama. There we go. This'll take him down for good. Drake is dead. Let's get some food. Anything in here I care about? Get some snacks. Okay, let's keep moving. Now that we are well and truly covered in zombie blood. Is reality? Yeah, pretty much. Katie. Oh no! The little girl's getting eaten! Get off her. Is there a zombie in here? No way. Katie, it's me, it's Daddy. Man, badass little girl. Ready to fight the zombies? Do the things? Okay, life's actually a little bit easier now that I'm holding Katie because it's actually harder for zombies to grab me when I'm holding Katie. Bye, Erwin. None of these people are savable. Every single person whose name you're seeing right now are all going to die and there's nothing I can do about it. So we're not going to waste any time with them. Okay, who's ready to see the best boyfriend ever?
worth remembering, you could not be any worse than this guy. That guy. Get to the safe house. I don't recognize that guy. I don't think he actually survives. The guy with the gun. Which is strange, given that he has a gun. The safe house, Chuck. The safe house. It's over there. Daddy. Yep. She did get ripped. And probably torn, too. We're gonna have to take our chances in there, kiddo. Time to run. Get to the doors quick before they close. I mean, look, if you're into zombies... When they say wear protection, they're not joking. Okay, we made it. I can't get a signal. Why? Why can't I get a signal? I can't play my phone games. She was she was looking right at me and they had her and I I couldn't do anything. She went down without a sound and I I had to get out of there. I just This guy's going to be telling himself that for the rest of his life. It's a good thing that's a very thick steel door, right? There's a congenial sort of guy. He looks nice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a second, son. A zombie would be a hell of an STD. How did he see Listen, that? It's an existing condition. All right, it's okay. It happened a long time ago. It's only a matter of time before she turns. Hey, don't worry. I've got Zombrex. Yeah, well, you better have a lot, because there ain't none here, and the rescue ain't coming for three Luckily, days. I know of at least two Zombrex locations yeah. that I can get some really, really fast. But their first priority is to quarantine the city, and that takes time. They'll enter the city at first light three days from now. That's the standard procedure. So I'm not too worried about having Zombrex for Katie. There's a couch in the security room. Why don't you take her in there? It's quieter. Hey, Sullivan's being kind of nice. You know, less of a dick. Oh, hey, look. There's that pounding on that door again. Good thing we have two different doors. And good thing these are very thick steel doors. I mean, those are some thick doors. You can mail one. That's actually the fourth one I can think of. Actually, I can think of like five off the top of my head that you can get without paying for it. Yep, thick door. We don't have any zombies. No, we don't. He lied. I was gonna get some right after the show. We still have time. Where are you gonna get it? Somewhere you let me in the mall. That, okay, kiddo? I know where you can get some. Oh? How long have you been listening? Long enough. I won't say anything. She doesn't want to see us kicked out. In the Royal Flush mall. I'm Stacy Forsythe, by the way. Hi, Stacy. I'm Chuck. And this is Katie. Hi, Chuck and Katie. Do you know a way out? Okay. Closed-circuit cameras all over the city. These monitors are playback only, but I'll keep an eye on them. 
Yeah, I'm nigh about that. If you find anyone alive out there, I'll do what I can. Keep an eye on my daughter, okay? And she pulls out a PSP. I don't know why she's playing a PSP on an Xbox game, but you know. Oh, hey, look. A map. How much time do the Zombax delivery? Uh, the delivery, I want to say, is like day two. Hey, look, air vents. This looks familiar. To your left, Chuck. Okay. So we're going to do a couple of different things really, really quickly. Oh, when you must give it to her? Uh, I forget what time it is. Gonna drop that because I don't need it. What do you got? Okay, what I do need, however, is this sledgehammer right here. Okay, so we gotta book it a little bit to get to uh, to do everything I want to do when I want to do it. Let's see, I forget what is that's health. I don't want that. Let's grab the Bowie knife. Okay. I used to be good at being able to dodge around these guys. Apparently, I'm not good at that anymore. Okay, let's see. Three... Looking for a four here. I keep on getting a two, though. Come on. I've gotten everything basically except for the number I need right now. Come on. Give me that four. Okay, apparently that die is not going to work with me. There we go. Why am I bothering with the die? Because when you get a 7, you get a big uh, experience point bonus. Like, a really big one. So, you see, I vaulted me up a very significant portion of the... Uh, of my experience, and I need to level up. So we get basically three psychopaths. I'm just getting hit by everything. I mean, it'll get better as we as we level up, but we're gonna get our first survivor here.
They don't have a safe. Don't buy hey, dirtbag. Let the lady go. Hey, here's Chuck being Chuck. Mind your own business, old man. Exactly what I'm doing. I'm just here looking for some Zombrex. Well, you're definitely going to need some painkillers when I'm done with you. Hey, that's a line. Talking to you is giving me a headache. Also line. Yeah? What say you give me some money and I'll go get some. I don't have any money, especially not $10,000. Where did you get a tomahawk? We done? We done. This is why we have a sledgehammer. To kill people. That worked out well. Hey, it's a key. I could just hop over the desk, but hey, I have a key. Okay. Gotcha. Got my Zombrex. What's going on? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, shut up. Okay, let's go save this woman. Okay, she's not hurt. We saved him. We're going to bring her back to the safe house. We just leveled up. Which got a new skill move. Stay close. Increase my health. Uh, let's go ahead and grab some orange juice. Don't fall behind. Keep close. Still there? Stick close. Stay close. Okay, we're going to deliver this first survivor, and then we're going to go, um... Keep going. Move it. Hurry up. We're going to deliver her, and then we're going to kind of move on and move Stick to our first me. psychopath fight. Keep it I could give her something, but there's no point. We're right here. Keep close. Follow me. Stick close. Let's go. Don't fall behind. Faster. Hurry up. Stay close. Keep moving. She's fine. Don't worry about those Keep baseball going. bat bruises to the face. Stick close. I don't know how that she got those. I don't know what you're talking about for a hammer. I don't have a hammer. I have a sledgehammer. That's Hold a little me. bit different. Okay, it is currently 4, 4 10 a.m. Kate doesn't need Zombrex for the three hours, so we got some time. Oh, I probably shouldn't have jumped in so quick because I don't think she's close enough to come in. Uh, they were. Cool. So Denise is safe. Quick thing with Sullivan. Where on earth did you find him? Never mind. I don't want to know. There's still people alive out there. We can't afford to have any infected in here. So he says. Okay. Uh, I forget. Is he gonna... Okay. Time for us to move on. Um, so, okay, we have to get to the Yucatan Casino. Like, right now. So, I'm gonna drop the Bowie knife in favor of... I guess an extra uh, sledgehammer if I can get it. Yep. Cool.
Okay, we got a long walk ahead of us. Or a long jog at the way that Chuck moves. Are the magicians in there? Uh, no. Different casino and different time of day. Different day entirely, in fact. Uh, whoops. That was not right. There we go. So, hole in one's gonna get us a little bit more uh, money. A little more experience. Excuse me, you're in the way. This is absolutely the time to golf. I don't know where you think we are. Of all the things I wish I had right now, that car, a very large one of them. There's a lot of these little environmental things that we can do. And, uh... I'd love to do some of them. Get some experience. Level up faster. Trying to avoid the main herd of zombies here. There we go. Neat. Let's go ahead and grab one of these. I can go really fast this way. Hey, we got a zombie with us. He's gonna be my friend. I'm gonna call him Ted. Okay, Ted. It's been nice knowing you. Okay, now we're at the Yucatan Casino. We've got two different survivors to save here. 